I'm Swara, a cloud support engineer here at AWS office in Bangalore, India. Sometimes customers ask me how they can automate the creation of AMIs of EBS-backed EC2 instances. So today I'll be showing you one of the methods using Systems Manager. Let's get started. The instances for which you want to create the AMIs using Systems Manager must be listed as managed instances under SSM. In this lab, we will create a maintenance window and then register an automation task for creating an AMI. Let's first create an IAM role with sufficient permissions to create an AMI for the maintenance window. After logging in to the AWS Management Console, navigate to the IAM Console. In the left navigation, select Roles and then choose Create Role. Select EC2 Service, choose Next Permissions. Enter Amazon SSM Maintenance Window Role in the search bar and select the policy, choose Next Tags. Enter a role name, SSM role Amy creation, and description. Choose create role. Go back to roles again, and then search for the role created just now, SSM role Amy creation. Choose add inline policy. Under choose a service, select EC2. Under Write Access Level, select Create Image Action. Under Read List Access Level, select Describe Images Action. Choose Review Policy and give the role a name. Choose Create Policy. Select the role again. And go to the Trust Relationships. Edit Trust Relationship. Add ssm.amazonaws.com. Click Update Trust Policy. Now navigate to Systems Manager Console. Then select Maintenance Windows under Actions in the left navigation of the page. Choose Create Maintenance Window. Give a suitable name and description for the maintenance window. Select Cron Schedule Builder under Schedule. I am choosing every Tuesday 12 p.m. UTC as a schedule for the maintenance window in this video. You can schedule the maintenance window as per your requirement. Specify the duration. I am giving the duration as 2 hours and 1 hour for stop initiating tasks. Choose create maintenance window. Now select the maintenance window which was created just now. Go to actions, register targets. Give the target a name and description. Select the targets, that is, the instances either based on tags or by manually selecting them. Choose Register Target. Now go back to the maintenance window which is created and go to Actions, Register Automation Task. Enter a name and description. Select the document. AWS create image. Now select the registered target group. You can also manually select the instances here if you haven't registered the targets. Select the concurrency and error threshold. I am specifying it to be 1 for both in this video. You can give these values as needed. Select the role created SSM role Amy creation earlier here. Under the input parameters, give the value for instance ID as target underscore ID. Note that the target underscore ID mentioned here is case sensitive. Target underscore ID passes the instances registered in the target as input to the automation document. 
If no reboot is selected as true, note that the file system integrity of the created image isn't guaranteed. The default value is false which will power down the instance before creating an AMI. Choose register automation task. By following these instructions, every Tuesday at 12 UTC, an AMI will be created for each targeted EC2 instance. With the help of the steps performed, an AMI can be created for both Windows and Linux instances. Note that sysprep is not performed on Windows instances before creating AMI using these processes described earlier. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.